All hail Biafra. This is Biafra Liberation Army Network coming to you again. Please do subscribe, like, share, and comment. Today, they have tried to bribe me with trillions of Naira. Instead of addressing the reason, I'm telling you the fact, they have just last week, I got the information that they are ready to make me the richest man in Africa. I said, I said to them, does it mean, does it mean that you people are not even interested in releasing Mazin Amdikano? Because that is what it means. I gave a simple demand, release Mazin Amdikano, and then we can see how far we can go with that. And that particular demand continue to stand. Otherwise, Biafrans will continue to hit you the hardest way. As it turned out, our hosts for this convention, Finland, fought their own war for their own freedom. Most people of this world fight to the end when faced with threat to their survival and well-being. You can't call me a terrorist and then praise Mandela. You can't call me a terrorist and make Gandhi a legend. However, my, my dream is to become more powerful than them. Because I know Nigeria is the most complex, complicated country, and I am fighting it in a, the same complicated way. I told them I will remain the equation they will never solve. Hello, Mr. But I haven't listened to the Prime Minister of Biafra in Ezra talking about uh, Samanekba, saying that they wanted to make him a billionaire, that they promised him trillions of naira, and of course that they wanted to make him the richest man in Africa. When he said that Hangote is the richest man in, Afri richest man in Africa, and it's like... Uh, Samaritan is resolute in what he believed in. If there was such an offer, and he turned it down because of Biafra struggle. But he said he placed a demand on the table that is the freedom of Maz and Kahlo. And according to him, that they didn't oblige as such that he's going to fight on. Let us get with you. Nigerians and Nigeria government always make me to, to, to laugh. They are funny people. Do you think that it's everybody can buy with money? Because they are so corrupt. Okay, you believe someone right now. Uh, he said, you believe him. I believe him. They cannot tell lie. They feel that everybody is corrupt. You, they didn't think that uh, 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 Sam was Rike. But don't you think it was wise you tried to verify whether he's saying the truth? I said, Sam Maneko is saying the truth. So you don't need to get a second verification. I, I don't need, I don't need to go investigation. The spirit of Ojuku is in Sam Maneko. The spirit of Nam Dekan is Sam Maneko. The truth is in the mouth of Sam Maneko. So, therefore, I don't need to think it twice whether what he said is truth or not. Nigeria is so corrupt that they follow everything in the corrupt way. Instead of them to follow the right way to solve the problem once and for all. So, you mean once he says something, you don't need to verify it? I don't need to verify it. One lie and lie. According to how man, I don't need to verify it. I don't need to, to verify it. And he's saying that Nigeria is a complex society, that his own approach is fighting in the complex way. Yes, this is why he's Simon Epa. Any way you take to come, he will follow you in that way. When you are drumming music for him, and he's dancing your music, a little the tune of music change, he will change his pattern of dancing. That's why he followed them in the complex, uh, 
complicated, complicated, complex way. Complex way. If they come turn back now in a truthful way, you follow them in a truthful way. If they turn back now in a in a in a in a in a in a, in a simple way, you follow them in a simple way. He don't give you condition, but you will bring that condition. He will follow you and you get tired with that condition. You see? Some or Nepa is not like people like uh, 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 Wazirike or people like uh, uh, Asir Dukubom or uh, Igbo politicians. It's not a Hanes and Igbo. How much want to be a member there? Therefore, how can you buy him with money? But I don't think it was wise. You do a background check of what he said before you draw inference whether he's actually saying the fact or not. He, I said this is more than fact. He's saying the truth. This is what he said is more than fact. What he said is the truth. Okay, look, look, look at it. What made Owasrike to back out? I'm not aware that Owasrike are backed out because up to today, Owasrike is still claiming that he's in the struggle. Yes, that's what they will say. What made DOS not to stand with the release of Nam de Kalo by allowing Monday sit at home to stand? I don't know anything about DOS. I'll just, I only hear it from your mouth. I don't know the meaning. Okay. DOS. They are, let me say, the I, the decision taking body in IPOB before Nam De Kalo was kidnapped. Now they are the one that collect money, arrange for Nam De Kalo kidnapping. Now turn things upside down. You make, sorry, sorry, sir. You make so much allegation that you may not be able to substantiate. But then you are accusing someone of collecting money. Is it something you have evidence to buttress? If I am a member of DOS, I can pick the document and give to you. But I am, I'm, I'm not the member of uh, uh, DOS. But, but nothing will happen in this world that will be sick so long. It must, one day it must surely burst out. What I'm and trying to say in a sense. If it bursts out, people like me, the new Oko them. We heard about it. And because I am Oko Kondem, the new Oko Kondem, I will speak out. And because I was born, I was born to speak the truth. And whatever I said, go uh, go look into it. At the end, it must surely be truth. No, you know what I'm trying to say in essence is the Bible says out of the matter of two witnesses is established. established. And if you allege in our contemporary society, there's a burden of proof that always is always on your shoulder. That is why at times I want to ask you. Is this something you have a good authority? Is it because are you relying on hearsay? Is you have evidence to back it up? Because it's good that when we make some level of allegation, we have evidence to back it up if we are called upon to prove it. Okay, my moderator, I will give you one assignment now. As a journalist, whatever I said, go and investigate. If if I am wrong, call me back to this your channel. And told me from and play where the whole world will see that I am wrong. That's the only assignment I'm giving you now. There's no need for you to argue me, but that's the only assignment I'm giving now. Let us go back to Simon Eber. Simon Eber is a man of integrity. And Simon Eber is a man who knows the writing and doing the writing. You know, he, okay, as he said that they want to lobby him with money to be one of the richest men in Africa. If Nigeria will make some money by one of the richest men in Africa, why can't they take that money and develop Southeast and stop marginalizing them? Yeah, but the question is, no, why do you I'm just believe him, lies, sink, and hookah I'm, upon his assertion without verification? Okay, are you accusing some money that is selling lie? I'm only asking because mm -hmm. I just asked a question, you say you believe him. I'm asking, is it not better? You verify whether he's saying the truth. This one I told you, if someone is not telling the truth, you say I should go and verify. Then I give you opportunity to go and verify what I am saying. Or you, as a, a, a journalist, to first of all verify someone. If what someone is saying is lying, then which means I am supporting a liar. I agree on that. You understand? But I am telling you that someone knows the right thing to do. If they want to, okay. Okay, let me put it in that this way. As far as you are not sure, you don't believe in Simon Nepa, what he said. No, I don't have an opinion. I'm is I'm the one asking question. I don't have opinion, I'm not fronting any opinion. I'm only asking that is it 
that you believe in like a hooker was it not proper you investigate you investigate whether his assertion is correct that's the point i'm trying to make okay now i don't need to inv investigate let me tell you the truth someone is a, a straightforward man he will not say what is not on the ground what he speak is truth i stand on this whether i verify I, ver I did not verify what he said is truth there's no two ways about it there's no two ways about it if that money they will take to make some people to be the richest one in in, in in africa why can't they take that money to go and develop south south develop southeast why don't they allow the seaport in south south the seaport in 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 in, 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 in uh, uh, the uh they call rivers river state the seaport in uh, aqua Ibom, the seaport in the cross river the seaport in worry the seaport in coco which is in uh, a do state why don't they allow this four seaport to be functioning okay now if we are to as a way of trying to no i'm coming if you were to speculate the quarter from where they may be trying to lobby him where do you think or who do you think may be trying to lobby him with money and all that who else who else than nigerian government who else than do those Iberiberiarism, Igbo politician will agitate it. Okay, take money to lobby. We know that he's an Igbo man. He will love money. Igbo, Igbo people love money. And maybe he had money, he will drop. But thank God, Simon Epa is not like that of the type of Igbo people that are Judas. Now, when they go and told him, they will make him more richer. They make him the richest man in Africa. Then where are they going to put Dangote? So are they going now they're going to scrap Dangote off? And take the position as the richest president's richest man in Africa and give to someone. Then where that go to be? That go to become the second richest man in Africa. Okay, now lastly on this, let us look at the last um notion he uh harp on that is is going to be an equation that they cannot resolve. Yes, the equation is you see they cannot resolve when they are trying to resolve equation, you mean you you balance things to be so he's mystic. Sam Onepa is more than what people think that he is. Is he mystic? Whether you call it mystic, whether you call it invisible, whether you call him spiritualist, whether you call, whatever you call him, is an equation that Nigeria cannot balance. Why I say it's an equation that Nigeria cannot balance? They cannot kidnap him, one. They cannot bribe Finland to repatriate him, two. They cannot buy him with money, three. They cannot assassinate him by God's grace. For so any way they take to come to apprehend some money, but they always be a failure. That is why he see an equation that they cannot balance. They feel that they have balanced them, they cannot. But some money, but they cannot balance him.